Hey, what's going on guys? Ellery is back to bring you another video. Today we are working on a roof tear off in the city of Northridge and I'm going to do several part videos because we are first replacing the roof before installing solar panels and we're also doing a main service panel upgrade. So just want to say thanks for watching guys and without further ado, let's do this. All right, let's do a quick walkthrough. For this home, there is this roofing material. There are two layers. The first layer is shingles, which is right here in the back side of the home. Here is the patio, which we haven't removed yet. First layer or the top layer is this. And underneath that is the second layer, which is a three tap shingle. Okay. So there are two layers on this roof. Now beneath the three tap shingles, we have the underlayment, which is this paper material and beneath that is the duct right here so our goal for today is to remove first layer second layer and the underlayment and to remove the nails as well these nails And to also repair parts of the roof that requires sheeting. For example, this. If there's any rotten wood or any of the deck that needs to be replaced, that will have to be done prior to the sheeting inspection. this one as well. And what's interesting is on the main house we have these one buys decking and on the back side which is the patio The sheeting is plywood. These are sheets instead of one bias. And we started from the front. We've got our truck, so when the layers are removed, we use these tarp and our tear off crew fills up. All the debris in the truck. And here's all of the debris from the tear off. We're also removing any of the drip edge, which was here. edge is this metal right here. This one is also removed during the tear off. There's 
where all the shingles go. And these go into a dump at the end of the day. Let's walk over here. Hey Margarita, what's up man? Wanna say hi? Hi. <laughs> the Margarita here is removing some of the nails. As we can see in this video. So the nails are removed so that when the new layer of underlayment and shingles are installed, they won't protrude or penetrate on the new shingles. So for example, if this was the new shingles and you have these nails that are sticking out, it will cause a hole or a penetration. So they have to be removed. The nails that stay are the nails that hold on to the deck here. So these nails are not removed. But the nails from those two layers are removed. And if we go to the perimeter of the house, we do put coverings so that when the debris falls, it doesn't make a mess on the porch and also on the back of the home. There's a pull back there, which we cover so that the debris doesn't fall there. And we're running on almost seven minutes and I'll say thanks for watching guys and I'll see you guys again on the next video. I'll do another video on replacing the wood deck and you'll see that after this. Thanks for watching guys, see you guys again. Bye.